हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर सौरभ पटवर्धन फ्रॉम नंदादीप आई हॉस्पिटल पी जी टीचिंग इंस्टीट्यूट एंड फेको एस आई सी एस ट्रेनिंग सेंटर सांगली महाराष्ट्र इंडिया इन अवर सेंटर वी हैव लॉट ऑफ टीचिंग एक्टिविटीज विच इंक्लूड हैंड्स ऑन ट्रेनिंग एज वेल हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू आइडेंटिफाई सेक्शन एंड वट इज द राइट टाइम फॉर रिपीटिंग द हाइड्रो डी सेक्शन on my youtube channel you will find many videos where i share many small tips which will help you in improving your surgical skills this is soft cortical cataract and uh, doing hydro dissection is even more essential when you are dealing with soft grade of cataract i am going to use hydripurkar capsule forceps here the viscoelastic used is hyaluronic which is a chondroitin sulfate and hydronate combination getting a good 5 mm capsule axis well centered is essential nowadays to get good refractive outcomes also small capsule axis is strict no for dissection and now you can see here when i did hydro dissection there was no anti movement of the nucleus while the hydro delineation was good as i tried to rotate the nucleus it was not rotating freely nonetheless i went ahead the plan here was to make a small but deep trench so i didn't want to do a wide trench i wanted to do a smaller trench but deep so that i can split the nucleus into two heavy nuclei here and that's what i could do here easily the right depth is important and now you can see that uh, when i try to rotate this nucleus it's not rotating that easily so when i try to rotate it further you can see there is resistance i am trying to do bimanual rotation here but still you can see the nucleus doesn't move that easily so that is a indication that the hydro dissection has not separated the nucleus from the capsular black and here i am trying to just aspirate out one hemi nucleus which i have divided but you can see because the hydro dissection is incomplete i find it very difficult to take this hemi nucleus out and if i continue to do this this is a risky maneuver because if i try to pull out this nucleus from the bag without proper hydro dissection essentially i am putting stress on the zone and i want to avoid that so i think this is the time where i must repeat hydro so the to repeat hydro dissection it is essential that you do use the same way that is go under the anti capsule till the periphery push some fluid here you can push more fluid because already you have divided the nucleus so you can there is no chance of hydro rupture of the posterior capsule so push more fluid and you will find that here when i pushed fluid there was anti movement of the nucleus and I, now i know that the nucleus is separated from the bag and now you can see how easily it rotates once it rotates you can see nucleus is already separated from the bag and also i did earlier so now taking it out from the bag is very very easy and i could do it very easily so that trick here was to identify that the hydro dissection was not complete where i felt more resistance while rotating this uh, nucleus and that is the time you must stop repeat the hydro dissection so that the remaining surgery becomes easier and safer so what is the take home message from this video always do good hydro dissection to begin with but there are cases where you find that the hydro dissection is incomplete that is when you find more resistance while rotating this nucleus and if you notice this resistance always repeat hydro dissection you can watch the two videos side by side you will find that if the hydro dissection is complete the rotation of the nucleus is effortless thank you